everyone. Welcome to Tales for Twos. My name is Miss Lorena and today I'm going to be reading stories all about dogs. So this is in honor of our um, dog adoption uh, going on September 11th from 11 a.m. until 1 p.m. Traveling Tales Rescue Dogs will be here at the library and will be available for adoption. So I hope that you can make it and then hopefully take um, a dog home for your family. So I'm gonna start off with our hello song and Biscuit here is going to help me uh, sing. So we're gonna start off with, hello everybody, can you clap your hands? Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Well, hello, everybody. Can you clap your hands? Clap your hands. Now we're going to wiggle our fingers. Hello, everybody. Can you wiggle your fingers? Wiggle your fingers. Wiggle your fingers. Well, hello, everybody. Can you wiggle your fingers? Wiggle your fingers. And then we'll stomp. Well, hello, everybody. Can you stomp your feet? Stomp your feet. Stomp your feet. Well, hello, everybody. Can you stomp your feet? Stomp your feet. And the last one is going to be wave hello. Well, hello, everybody. Can you wave hello? Wave hello. Wave hello, well hello everybody, can you wave hello, wave hello. Good job. Now I'm going to set Biscuit over here so we can listen to our stories today. And I do have my shapes here. If you can remember what they are, we'll start um, with this orange oval, pink square, yellow circle, green rectangle, red heart, and blue triangle. So I do have a little puppy that has gone missing if you want to help me try to find him behind one of these shapes. So where, oh where has my little puppy gone? Oh where, oh where can she be? Let's look under the blue triangle. Nope, not there. Where, oh where has my little puppy gone? Oh where, oh where can she be? Can she be behind the yellow circle? No, she's not there either. Where, oh, where has my little puppy gone? Oh, where, oh, where can she be? Let's try the orange oval. No luck. Hmm. Where, oh, where can my little puppy be? Oh, where, oh, where can she be? Maybe we should try behind the red heart there she is she was hiding behind this little red heart oh my good job and thank you so much for helping me find her now i do have my first book here and it is called this book just ate my dog and this is by Richard Byrne. Bella was taking her dog for a stroll across the page when... Oh no! Something very odd happened. disappeared. She, let's see. Hello, Bella. What's up? 
said Ben. This book just ate my dog. Ben decided to investigate. And there he goes. But Ben disappeared too. Suddenly, help zoomed in. Then vanished. Things were getting ridiculous. I'll just have to sort this out myself, thought Bella. But, burp. Sometime later, a note appeared. It read, Dear reader, it would be lovely if you could kindly help us. Please turn this book on its side and shake. Bella. So here it says, turn book around and shake. All right. All right, we turned it around. Now I'm gonna shake it. Ooh. Let's see if it helped. Oh, and shake, and shake, and shake. They're all coming out. And one last little wiggle. Thank you, Bella. And everyone appeared. And things got back to normal. Uh -uh. Well, almost. Dear reader, please tell this book to promise not to be so naughty next time you read it. Thank you, Bella. The end. Man, that was one naughty book, huh? All right, now I have a little tune here for you and it goes, if you're a dog and you know it, wag your tail. So I'm gonna use biscuit here to help and then he's gonna wiggle his tail if you're a dog and you know it wag your tail if you're a dog and you know it wag your tail if you're a dog and you know it and you really want to show it if you're a dog and you know it wag your tail all right if you're a dog and you know it scratch your ear if you're a dog and you know it scratch your ear if you're a dog and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're a dog and you know it, scratch your ear. And then how about bark like this? Woof, woof. If you're a dog and you know it, bark like this. Woof, woof. If you're a dog and you know it, bark like this. Woof, woof. If you're a dog and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're a dog and you know it, bark like this. Woof, woof. Good job. All right, I'm gonna set Biscuit down again and go to our second book. And it's called Dogs in Cars. And this is by Felix Massey and Emmanuel Walker. All right, let's see what kind of dogs we see. One Afghan hound, hair blowing with blowing locks. Two eager beagles, riding with a fox. Three Welsh corgis, trying to work a jack. Four spotted Dalmatians trying to get back. Five fluffy Eurasiers riding round in force. Six friends.
French Bulldogs, graceful as a prancing horse. Seven Great Danes, ears ready and alert. Eight Basset Hounds, ears dragging in the dirt. Nine Irish setters avoiding a pothole of gold. Ten Jack Russells going off road. Eleven King Charles Spaniels paying a bridge toll. Twelve Naughty Labradors unrolling toilet roll. Thirteen Yapping Maltese with the roof down low. Fourteen Newfoundlands with a barrel in tow. Fifteen Old English Sheepdogs covered in paint. Sixteen Poodles going so fast they might faint. Seventeen Queensland healers moving along. Eighteen Rottweilers rolling nice and strong. Nineteen Shih Tzus fitting comfortably in the boot. Twenty Terriers making off with some loot. 21 Utanagans off to get some snow. 22 Volpinos being foxy all for show. 23 Whippets with the wind in their hair. See if Miss Lorena can say this. Twenty-four Charlotte's Quintles thinking it's not fair. Twenty-five Yorkshire Terriers see something up ahead. Fifty Zukons, look out! One hundred cats being fed. The end. All right, now I have one last song for you here before our last book and that it goes ears whiskers paws and tail so can I have biscuit here help me again so it goes ears whiskers paws and tail paws and tail ears whiskers paws and tail paws and tail Fur and eyes and mouth and claws. Ears, whiskers, paws and tails, paws and tails. All right, good job. And time for our last story here. And this is called Walk Your Dog. And this is by Elizabeth Stevens Omlor. Greet your dog. 
So in the mornings, you want to say hello to your dog. Groom your dog. Feed your dog. Dress your dog. Walk your dog. Chase your dog. Catch your dog. Train your dog. Treat your dog. Clean your dog. Settle your dog. And most of all, you want to love your dog. The end. All right, now it's time for our goodbye song. And Biscuit here is back. So we clap and sing goodbye. We clap and sing goodbye. With our friends at story time, we clap and sing goodbye. And then we'll stomp. We stomp and sing goodbye. We stomp and sing goodbye. With our friends at story time, we stomp and sing goodbye. And then we'll wiggle. We wiggle and sing goodbye. We wiggle and sing goodbye. With our friends at story time, we wiggle and sing goodbye. And then we'll wave goodbye. We wave and sing goodbye. We wave and sing goodbye. With our friends at story time, we wave and sing goodbye. All right, thank you so much for tuning in and I hope you can make it to our dog adoption event on September 11th from 11 a.m. until 1 p.m. Don't forget, and we'll see you again soon.